This is a gamer, and he is engaging in a curious ritual in which he shares his opinions on an obscure video game. No one is quite certain how this activity has evolved, yet there is speculation on why it is so crucial to their evolutionary survival. Some believe it to be a sort of mating ritual, as our gamer seeks to expand his social network via the internet in the hopes of attracting a potential mate. Because they are often unsuccessful, others believe it to be a form of peer-to-peer -peer bonding in order to increase the solidarity of the gaming community. Most do not care one way or the other. Yet, for the purpose of this documentary, I will be attempting to answer some fundamental questions regarding this curious offshoot of the Homo sapien. This is The Life of Gamers. To understand our gamer, we must first take a look back at his early ancestors. Lucky for us, just one such specimen exists here in this great oak tree. Let's see if we can't entice him out with a tasty treat. You may be wondering why this particular creature took such a dramatically different evolutionary path. This has been attributed to the lack of large screen televisions and next generation gaming consoles in the environment in which he has existed for generations. It is believed that these factors are the reasons why he has maintained his small stature, as most of his ancestors descended the safety of the trees to seek a wider gaming pasture. Notice the extreme dexterity in his hands. We have reason to believe that the advanced muscle tone of the ever-crucial thumb has given the early gamer a distinct advantage when tackling difficult games. A strong callus has formed, enabling for repeat button mashing over the course of several hours, occasionally days. These same traits can be found in our modern gamer. Observe. Indeed, the gamer's thumb is one of his most prized attributes, and he will take great care in maintaining its usefulness. What luck! We've stumbled across a bizarre ritual, rarely documented before. In fact, these may be the first moments such activities have been captured on film. It's a role player no doubt preparing for a future event, perhaps a convention, to show off his elaborate costume. Much like Birds of Paradise, this unique type of gamer goes to great lengths preparing and maintaining his metaphorical plumage. He is a secretive one, protective of his costume design, lest there be duplicators. And it appears as though we've spooked him. He will not appear in costume again for several months. He may in fact go through several redesigns and revisions due to our intrusion. Possibly going into manga. The life of gamers is a complex one, stretching back through history and onwards into the unknown future we can only know so much about these unique individuals. But research continues on, despite a lack of any form of funding or encouragement from the Humanities Society. What wonders await us in our search for understanding? We may never know. <laughs>